Have you ever stopped to ponder what makes our planet Earth so incredibly unique? Situated third in line from the Sun, Earth occupies a position in our solar system that is nothing short of a cosmic miracle. It finds itself at the Goldilocks distance from the Sun, a place not too hot, not too cold, but just right to allow the existence of liquid water, a vital ingredient for the recipe of life. But it's not just the Earth's location that makes it so special. The planet's axial tilt, a slight 23.5 degrees off from the perpendicular to its orbital plane, orchestrates a symphony of seasons. This tilt causes sunlight to be distributed unevenly across the Earth, leading to a cyclical shift between summer and winter. The tilt allows for a beautiful diversity in climate and biodiversity across the globe, from the frosty poles to the sweltering tropics. Now imagine the Earth spinning, rotating on its axis once every 24 hours. This rotation is the maestro behind the rhythmic dance of day and night. As the Earth turns, different parts of the planet face the sun, bathing in its light, while others are turned away, enveloped in darkness. This ceaseless cycle of light and dark influences everything from our sleep patterns to the behavior of countless species around the world. Consider the moon, our closest celestial neighbor, whose gravitational pull causes the rise and fall of ocean tides. These tides, in turn, influence marine life, coastal ecosystems, and even human civilizations. Each of these elements, the Earth's position, its tilt, rotation, and the Moon's influence, together create a finely tuned orchestra playing the symphony of life. These factors, in perfect harmony, make Earth not just a planet, but a living, breathing entity, teeming with life in all its myriad forms. The Earth, with its perfect balance, supports life in a way that no other planet in our solar system does. But how does it do that? Let's delve deeper into the mysteries of our beautiful blue planet in the upcoming scenes. Dive beneath the waves and you'll find the secret ingredient to life as we know it, water. This simple molecule, comprised of two hydrogen atoms bonded to one oxygen atom, is the cornerstone of existence. It's the lifeblood of our planet, quenching the thirst of every living organism and playing a vital role in our survival and evolution. Water is not just a drink to quench our thirst. It's the orchestra conductor of a symphony that plays out across the globe, day in, day out. This symphony is the water cycle, a continuous process that moves water from the ocean to the atmosphere and back again. It begins with evaporation, as the sun's heat causes water to transform into vapor. Rising into the sky, it forms clouds, which then release their bounty as rain or snow, replenishing the land and sea. It's a beautiful, endless ballet, choreographed by nature herself. On Earth, water wears many faces. It flows in mighty rivers, carving out valleys as it meanders towards the sea. It stretches out in vast oceans, covering more than 70% of our planet's surface, it freezes into polar ice caps, reflecting the sun's rays and helping to regulate our climate. It even floats in the sky as clouds, casting shadows that dance across the landscape below. But water's influence extends beyond the physical. It shapes our societies and cultures, our economies and technologies. It's at the heart of our myths and legends, our arts and sciences. It's a source of inspiration and wonder, a symbol of life and renewal. In its abundance, water has painted our world in shades of blue and green, fostering a diverse range of habitats and species. Yet, despite its ubiquity, it's a precious resource that we must cherish and protect. For without water, there would be no life. There would be no us. Water, the life-giving elixir, shapes our world in profound ways, yet it's not the only factor that makes Earth unique. Inhale deeply and feel the clean, oxygen-rich air fill your lungs. Now, imagine a world without trees. Unthinkable, isn't it? Yet these verdant beings that we so often take for granted are the very lifeblood of our existence. They are the green lungs of our planet, a constant, silent force that tirelessly works to keep us and countless other species alive and thriving. Our forests, our green canopies, are the world's most vital organ. They breathe in carbon dioxide, a potent greenhouse gas, and exhale oxygen, the very essence of life. A single mature leafy tree can produce as much oxygen in a season as 10 people inhale in a year. Now multiply that by the over 3 trillion trees on Earth. It's an oxygen factory on a global scale, a testament to the wonders of nature. But their role doesn't stop there. 
Forests are also the epicenters of biodiversity on Earth. They are home to more than 80% of the world's terrestrial species. From the smallest insects to the largest mammals, from the tiniest fungi to the oldest trees, forests are teeming with life, each organism playing a crucial role in maintaining the balance of our ecosystem. And let's not forget, these green lungs also act as Earth's thermostat. By absorbing carbon dioxide, they help regulate our planet's temperature, keeping global warming in check. Without them, our world would be a much hotter, much less hospitable place. Yet despite their immense importance, we are losing forests at an alarming rate. Deforestation for agriculture, logging and urbanization is threatening these vital ecosystems. It's a sobering thought, isn't it? So the next time you take a deep breath of fresh air, remember the green lungs that made it possible. Appreciate the intricate web of life that thrives under their canopy and consider what you can do to help protect and preserve these vital ecosystems. The green lungs of our planet are indeed a testament to Earth's life-sustaining capabilities, but there's more to Earth's story. From the frigid poles to the scorching deserts, Earth's diverse ecosystems are a testament to life's resilience. Let's embark on a journey across the globe, beginning in the arid expanses of Earth's deserts. Amidst the endless sand dunes and under the relentless sun, life finds a way. Here, creatures have adapted to the harsh conditions, with camels storing water in their humps and cacti minimizing water loss with their prickly exterior. Next, we venture into the dense, humid jungines of the rainforests, where life bursts from every crevice. Towering trees form a canopy, creating a world within a world teeming with insects, birds and mammals. The rainforest is a symphony of biodiversity, where every creature plays a vital role in maintaining the balance of this lush ecosystem. Now let's dive beneath the ocean surface to the vibrant world of coral reefs. Often referred to as the rainforests of the sea, these reefs are home to a quarter of all marine life. From the smallest plankton to the grandest whale, each species contributes to the intricate web of life that thrives in these underwater cities. Our journey ends in the icy wilderness of the tundra. Here, in the harshest of conditions, life persists. Hardy creatures like the polar bear and the arctic fox with their thick fur coats not only survive, but thrive in these sub-zero temperatures. Even in this frozen landscape, the cycle of life continues, undeterred by the icy winds and snow. Each of these ecosystems, from the deserts and rainforests to the coral reefs and tundra, supports a unique ensemble of life. The organisms that inhabit these ecosystems have adapted to their environments in remarkable ways, demonstrating the incredible diversity of life on our planet. These diverse ecosystems, each with its unique inhabitants, create a vibrant tapestry of life on Earth. So what does all this mean for us, the inhabitants of this extraordinary planet? Well, it's quite simple. The Earth, with its mesmerizing blue waters, vibrant green forests and diverse ecosystems, is not just a planet. It's our home. It's the only home we have. And like any home, it needs care and attention. It needs us to be mindful of how we live, what we consume, and how we interact with the other residents, the countless species that share this home with us. The challenges we face are daunting. Climate change, a spectre that haunts our collective future, is altering the very fabric of our world. Increasing temperatures, rising sea levels, and extreme weather patterns are not just headlines, they are realities we must confront. Then there's deforestation, the steady erosion of the green lungs of our planet. Trees which have stood as silent witnesses to our history are disappearing at an alarming rate. The consequences are not just aesthetic, they're existential. Forests play a crucial role in maintaining the balance of our planet's climate and their loss is something we can ill afford. And let's not forget pollution. Our rivers and oceans are choked with plastic, our air filled with toxins. We've turned parts of our home into a dumping ground and it's affecting the health of all its inhabitants. But amidst these challenges, there's hope. We have the power to change. We can reduce our carbon footprints, plant more trees, recycle and reduce waste. We can use technology to clean our rivers and oceans and to create cleaner, more sustainable ways of living. We can educate ourselves and others about the importance of biodiversity and make choices that support it. In the grand cosmic theater, Earth is our only home. It's up to us to protect it, for ourselves and for the countless other species that share it with us.